Hi, this is Greg Michael. I'm changing today the strings of my Les Paul guitar and I thought it would be good to actually share with you my little trick to reduce the tension of strings of, of my guitar. When, when I bought this guitar originally, it, 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 it came uh, with you know, the normal setup of, 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 the, of the strings as you would expect. But, uh, but the thing is that it, I've noticed that the tension of strings was so, 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 so high that I had to do something about this. So I researched the um, internet as you do, and then I discovered that some people wrap their strings over the tailpiece of the of the bridge. So you know what it does actually is it it reduces the tension of strings, and I guess allows you to bend higher. So so you know I uh, I went for it and I and I started rest restringing guitars my my Les Paul style guitars this way, but then. I realized that that the bass, uh, the the bottom strings, you know, sound uh, that to lose, you know, when it's kind of hard to play uh, rhythm guitar, it just doesn't doesn't feel and sound right. So what I decided to do is this: I actually mix the way I I, I string my guitar. So basically, the the top strings are wrapped around the tailpiece, and the bass strings are just. Fed uh, through through the the tailpiece as, as as normal, so so it actually creates you know higher tension, and it, it helps me to play the rhythm. I mean, it's, it just makes it easier. So because you know I don't really want my bottom strings to be as as loose you know as the top strings, you know I don't bend that much the the bass strings anyway. You know you wouldn't probably do that too. So here we are. Check, check, check this angle. I hope that you can see it in the camera. Nice and steep angle on, on the, on the strings like uh, D, A, and E, and then strings E, B, and G. You have that nice kind of an shallow angle, I would say. So, so this guitar, I mean, needs to restringing. So I'll be doing this uh, exactly the same way. I have two other guitars here, like a ES three three five and and that uh, agile kind of uh, Les Paul copy, and and I do exactly the same thing. So it's it's it's, it's very simple. You know, you you just have to th feed. You just have to feed the strings if you want to wrap it around uh, from from other side. You know, feeding it this way, as opposed to that way. So so. That's it. So this is my little secret, you know, to keep uh, the string tension low when it's needed and high when it's needed too. So I hope that uh, it will help you or, or, you know, maybe inspire you to do something like that. Give it a go. Uh, or let me know what you do, right, to, to, to reduce your string tension. You know, are you, do, do you have your strings completely wrapped around or, or you, you just do the normal thing? Let me know. Okay. Uh, see you next time. Cheers. Bye-bye.